system because, for example, trying to see how a breast pump works, you cannot find a video of a breast pump being used. There is pornography on Instagram. Um, I won't say whose account, but I know someone that you know or um, often post pornographic content. I also, as many other women will say, uh, receive unsolicited genital pictures from men on a regular basis. Now, these tech platforms s claim that they can't do anything about it. But here is the stat. So, team... It doesn't matter if there's one... I can't say that it kept me awake at night thinking, hey, this is either awful or this is wonderful. It, it <laughs> seemed to be terribly exciting. Uh, we can't get away from it. It's well saying that, oh, breasts are for, for, for providing milk for babies. OK. Um, you can't stop men thinking they're sexy. And you can't, you can't then say, oh, well, you know, we must stop that. And, and other women. And whenever, in Hollywood, they used to have this thing about if a couple was on a bed, they could kiss, but only if one of them kept their foot on the floor. I mean, just crazy ways of trying to make sure that it wasn't too sexy, trying to make sure it wasn't this or that. And the moment you start drawing these lines and you then start saying, well, wait a minute, what, is there a matter of principle here? So if there's going to be a sex education programme, mm. how is that going to differ from pornography? Well, to some people, mm. not very much. There won't be much of a difference. I think that so you've got... So you